Welcome back to AM Northwest. Unhealthy teeth not only impact your physical health, they also affect your mental health. Here to share how implant dentures could have you smiling again, we welcome back from Sleep Dentistry to find Dr. Heath Lampy. Always good to see you. Thank you, Helen. Um, so first of all, talk, talk to me about implant dentures and how it works. So implant dentures are for patients who already are missing their teeth or need to have their teeth taken out. And we can actually put in implants in the jaws now and do either um, snap-in prosthetics or screw-in prosthetics so patients can eat confidently, they can uh, go out to, to work without their dentures falling out, they can go to dinner. Basically, they're in there all the time, and so they're able to eat and have confidence again. This, where, is, this is huge. It is. Because, you know, there was a time when dentures fell out all the time, or you had to put them in the glass next yeah. to your, your or, bed. Or in your pocket. Or in your pocket. Yeah, yeah that kind of stuff. Um, so in the last 15 years, implant technology has really changed to um, allow people to have this confidence when they're eating with the implant dentures, um, unlike what was around for the last 100 years. Right. Um, so the last 15 years, just a complete um, change in what we can do for our patients. Tell me about Victoria. Victoria came in about six months ago, and um, she was really, really unhealthy, COPD heart issues, um, you know, a lot of doctor's appointments, uh, a lot of medications, and she didn't know um, how long she was going to live. But she knew that her, her teeth were making her sick. She had 12 teeth left, and all of them were terribly infected. Wow. And, and do we, I mean... And that's what it looked like when we wow. kind of pulled back the lips, so yeah. a lot of missing teeth, but underneath all those teeth, infected roots, infected gums, all draining into her systems, where her body was already fighting so much other um, issues, diseases, right. conditions, that this was exacerbating it beyond belief, where she didn't know how long she was gonna live. Wow, and did she, did she not want to come in because she was embarrassed by the whole situation? She wanted to come in. Yes, she was embarrassed. Yeah. But like for so many of my so many of my patients, she didn't think there was any hope. There was nothing we could do. Yeah, nothing. Yeah. But she came in, and I'm like, yeah, we can do this. She had enough bone. I saw the the condition the the bone is in the teeth. And I'm like, yeah, we can do this. But the thing is, we needed to figure out could she handle it? Could her body right. handle it? So we checked with her doctors, and they were okay with it. All right, take me through the process. Okay, so in one day, we were able to... I'm sorry, I guess we didn't show the after. I apologize. Let's see the <laughs> okay. after. She there's the great. after, there's the after. She's a new person there. Um, so in one day, we were able to take out all the teeth, all the infected teeth, get all the infection out. We were also able to put in eight dental implants that same day. Four on the top, wow. four on the bottom. I let her heal for about four months before I actually connected the new teeth to the implants. So in four months, we had all the implants heal, all the infection was out of her mouth, and at four month mark, we connected everything. And she can eat what she wants now, she can go about, she can smile. She has a new lease on life where when I met her, she didn't know if she would see her grandkids graduate from high school. Wow. And I'm talking to her just in the last week, there is a radiance to her that she's going to live forever, basically, yeah. and she knows she's going to see she's her She's not brain. only feeling physically better, but mentally better. It, it astounds me every time in that there's a, a physical transformation, right. but also a mental transformation, and it's that that basically we all need health, we all need hope. Mm -hmm. And this is kind of what it offers, and it's a whole new start, basically, for the rest of her life. Yeah. I bet she's walking with a big stride. Oh my gosh, That's yes. That's so great. Yeah. And I know you're walking with a big stride because you're now a new dad. Yes, baby boy Lampy was born Friday at 8.29 p.m., uh, 6 pounds, 11 ounces. Uh, mom and uh, baby Roan are healthy. Right. And yeah. is, are you guys getting any sleep? Um, I got six hours last night. Okay, good. Um, I think she only got a couple. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but I have this Thursday off. And I'm starting baby duty tomorrow night. That's so awesome. So I am there. I did grocery shopping yesterday. I made dinner. So I'm making sure that she has has everything she needs. That's good. So. Good job. That's a good husband and a good dad. <laughs> Thank I want to tell you. folks, if you'd like to find out anything more, contact Sleep Dentistry Defined at 503-646-2273.